Hello there, wonderful humans. This is a walkthrough of Arc's pathway generator and a new command in Arc called I don't understand. Arc allows anybody, the learner or the teacher to put in an interest or a job description and create a learning pathway. So if a learner is in interested in airplane engineering, they can go and type that in and generate a learning pathway of key concepts and skills to understand more about airplane engineering. Now, this is really great because teachers can't be expected to be domain experts in everything. And this allows them to have a trusted AI co-pilot to allow the learner to follow their interests, follow their passions, and start getting engaged with this new found passion of theirs or a um, new career aspiration that they have. So here you can see that it's recommending classes in the city as a school network. There's a couple different lessons and live classes that they can join. There's also free resources on the web here. So you can see that's gone out to YouTube. And we also connect to other platforms like Udemy, Coursera. And right here is a list of the core concepts and skills broken down into a five module curriculum, starting from first principles and then getting into more complex subjects. And so this is already a great touch point for teachers and learners to say, hey, what do you know? What don't you know? So that's our pathway generator. The new feature I want to show you in Arc is actually, I don't understand. So what we've found is that learners are actually often stuck moving forwards in class because there's a misunderstanding in their knowledge. And it's not because the whole thing is confusing to them. It's actually a very specific thing. And so the, I don't understand command is for learners who might be stuck on a specific type of maths formula or a specific skill or concept in science. Right now, I've just typed in the idea of triangles. Let's say the learner comes up to you and says, teacher, I don't understand triangles. And what we want to find out is what is it specifically that they don't understand about triangles. And so what Arc's doing here is basically saying, great, I'm excited to know that you want to learn more about triangles. What is it specifically that you don't understand about applying knowledge of triangles? Is it the different types of triangles? Is it how to calculate the area of different triangles? Is it understanding Pythagoras theorem? And so this allows a learner to self-direct their own grappling with new understanding and try and be specific about what it is that they want more help with. They can then say, oh, it's actually, I don't understand Pythagorean theorems. They can continue the conversation and unblock themselves or work with a teacher to unblock themselves. This is the two different types of ways that we see learners basically engaging with Arc to keep themselves self-directed, to keep following their interests. And in a later video, I'll show you how learners can create projects and scaffold their own project-based learning uh, and work with teachers to complete the tasks associated with their different projects. For instance, a learner might want to create a, a soap product line, and then we can use Arc to generate the to-dos and scaffold the project-based learning. But thank you for listening and do check out Arc at arc.cityasaschool.com.